Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. Hope everyone's having a fabulous day. Here in Southern Ontario, the heat continues. As a matter of fact, we were just issued with a heat warning statement up until Wednesday. So we're hitting the high to mid 30s. And for the most part, that's without the Humidex. With the Humidex, we can be going as close as 40 degrees. So it is a scorcher here. Comment down below, let me know how everyone's weather is where you're watching from because here it's unbearably hot. But that's not what we're here to talk about. We're here to share with you my grocery haul for this week. And again, it's a no frills grocery haul. It isn't overly large because we still had a lot of protein and other items from our last grocery. So these were more items that we needed to pick up because either we ran out or just things that we needed. Anyways, if you like grocery hauls and if you like no frills, please keep on watching. Okay, so let's start off with the ketchup. I purchased this large 750 ml ketchup. This is the no sugar added. So I picked up that. Next to the ketchup, we picked up some long grain parboiled rice and the girls love a rice so we picked some of that up over here we've just picked up some of the ritz sandwiches uh, with cheese filling and these are just for you know, quick snacks or isabella likes to bring these in her lunches we also picked up some of the president's choice decadent chocolate chip cookies I'm pretty sure everyone's tried these, but for those who haven't, these are really, really good. I really enjoy these. I enjoy these more than the, um, what is it, Chips Ahoy? Yeah, these are really good. We picked up some of the little mini buns. Isabella's is not much of an eater, so we have to make things small and bite-sized. So we picked some of those up just to make little tiny sandwiches for her. That way maybe she'll eat them. In the back, we can't probably see, just picked up some Lay's chips, the family size. We also picked up a Sequest shrimp ring. There's 50 to 60 shrimp, just as a quick little snack when we don't really feel like cooking because we really don't feel like cooking in this heat. So just a little snack. We also picked up some of this cauliflower. This is the uh, frozen cauliflower florets. Oops, you probably can't see those. I'm out of frame. So we picked up some of those. I'm trying to eat less sugar, less carbs, um, hence here the, the no sugar added ketchup. But I love my loaded baked potato. So there's this fabulous recipe where you substitute the potato for cauliflower. And oh my gosh, it's so, so good. So I guess you can say I'm trying out the keto diet, low carb, that kind of diet, just, just eliminating a lot of carbs and sugar. So this is really, really good. We got some scallopini pork. So we got some of that. And this is from the meat counter. We got some onions. We also got some sea salt, because I love sea salt, right? rather than the regular salt. We got some heavy whipping cream. Because part of this keto kind of diet, you have to incorporate fat as well. Let me know down below if anyone here is on the keto diet because I would love to chat. I would love to share some recipes. So let me know if anyone's doing it. I, I'm interested to know. Again, I'm not following it 100%. I've just kind of, you know, started doing my homework and trying to incorporate it more in my daily life, but let me know. I picked up some of the cocoa powder. This is organic and it is gluten-free and sugar-free. 
picked up some chicken broth as usual. I picked up two packages as you can see there. So I'm gonna put some of this stuff away and I will be right okay, back. Okay, and lastly, this is more just the fruits and vegetables. So we picked up some Roma tomatoes. We picked up two packages of button white mushrooms. I love button mushrooms. Picked up some green onions. We got some jalapeno peppers and I saw this recipe for stuffed jalapeno peppers, like with cream cheese, like I guess jalapeno poppers. So I'm dying to try that. We got some bananas. We got a cauliflower because I've been eating tons and tons of cauliflower. It's so good. It's like a substitute like for potato for a lot of stuff like you could do um, mashed cauliflower and you can really really make it taste like potatoes trust me i was skeptical but yes you can got some spinach so i'm gonna try out this um, spinach and chicken recipe that i'm trying i'm dying to try out so hopefully it turns out good and if it does i'd love to share it on my channel and lastly, I picked up some fresh cilantro. And that is it. That was my grocery haul this time around. Remember to give me a thumbs up if you enjoy it. Remember to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Please remember to share. And once again, please remember to hit that little bell icon because that will ensure each and every time I upload a video, you'll never miss me. So again, Thank you everyone so much for watching. I, I love you guys and we'll talk very soon. Bye everyone.